Hello, in this episode I'd like to show you uh, a new feature in Microsoft Teams Meeting which is called a uh, pause rating. Uh, let's show you how it is. So I will create a new meeting, I will click, I'll give it a name and I will invite Alex. I will send it and now I will en enter the meeting in edit mode. Now I will click on a plus to add an app which is called Polls. In the past we would use Forms. The Polls is actually uh, the app which is re replacing it. Here we see some uh, newest uh, information. You can read that later. Let's click on Save. So actually what we see here is that we can see suggestions of all kinds of Polls. We can see here a uh, recent polls and we can click on for a new poll. Here we, we will see all of the uh, types of polls that exist. So we have multiple choice, we have quiz, we have word cloud, rating and the new uh, type is a ranking. So let's click on it. Here we can put uh, the poll that we want. So I'll just uh, copy a uh, question, greatest NBA players, and uh, let's paste that and let's put some uh, some values so Michael Jordan and we have uh, who do we have Magic Johnson and we have Kareem so let's do that fast that's not the whole point it's just an example of course it can be some something to do with the meeting we can choose uh, if to delete if we want to arrange it differently and we want if the answers will be shuffled. We can choose this additional uh, information, record names uh, of uh, respondents, uh, to share aggregated results and to allow co-presenter to edit the poll. So let's mark all of them and click on save draft. Now we will join the meeting and we will see the experience actually with two users. So I'm joining. I will shut down all of this in order not to affect uh, the voice. So oh, this is one user that we have here and we'll move it to the side. This other user will join the meeting and he will shut down the microphone. And actually, uh, the user that created the poll, uh, he I, might have a, a icon of the polls. If he doesn't see it, he can click on the three dots and now he sees the polls. What he can do is actually to launch it because currently it's in draft. So if you look here, we can edit the poll, delete it or launch it. So we just launched it and actually, uh, um, this user actually can uh, rank it. So let's say Magic Johnson is first, then Kareem, and then uh, lastly is Mike, uh, Michael Jordan. He will submit and he will see one response and he will see how he has voted. The other user will see in the three dots, he sees, he goes to the conversation and he will click on view poll and he will see and he will rank as he wants. So let's say um, he says uh, Magic is second and Jordan is third and Kareem is uh, first. He will submit and actually he will see his result and now he will see actually an average. So we see here uh, all of the information actually uh, is probably an, an average. So this is an, a new possibility and once he has that he can, um, he can give a name to the poll and he can also export the results and he can see the results by by each user. So let's see. You see Ami, this is the rating first, second and third. 
Alex has done that and he can export that in this way. So hope you enjoyed it and see you in the next episode.